Hi folks, welcome to my channel, my name is Mike, and today we are not wasting any time talking about the Helios 44-2 lens. It's a $50 lens, and it's dope as fuck. So this is a really good time for us, because we're stuck inside all the time, to work on our creative pursuits, to work on our skills, to get a new skill, to start something new. So lots of people right now are looking into photography, they're trying out photography, maybe they just purchased a GH5, and they're looking at different lenses you could get. So what makes this lens really interesting, this is a manual lens from, I think this is built in like the Czech Republic, uh, it could be Russian, I'm not too sure to be honest, and it doesn't matter. This is a $50 lens to add character to any of your shooting. It's a fully manual lens. The aperture is de-clicked or clicked if you want it to be. Uh, you can find these things like crazy on eBay or even Amazon right now. And so you're looking at uh, a lens that you can experiment with fairly fast at 2.0 aperture and 50 bucks. To give you some comparison, this is my Laowa 7.5 mil lens, and this came to about $700 Canadian. 50 bucks, 700. You do the math. This is a really good deal. So this is a 58 millimeter lens, 2.0, which means it's equivalent on the GH5 system of 116 mil. It's definitely closer to the telephoto long lens side of the spectrum, which is what gives you that nice bokeh, that nice creamy background. And that's really what this lens is known for, is that nice creamy background. It's not the sharpest lens. It's not gonna give you the sharpest picture quality out of your GH5 or a camera system. So what it will do is add character. This is like popping on a black mist filter on a lens that you already have, but this is the full lens and it's only 50 bucks. So what's beautiful about it is that you can experiment with this and you're not breaking the bank, which is really uncommon when it comes to lenses. So here's the deal. Is this gonna be your number one lens in your pack? Probably not, no. This is like, it's an effect lens. I mean, it's certainly closer to the telephoto size, if not long lens when it gets on the GH5. So it's not the easiest lens to work with. Something that I would recommend to really open up the capabilities of it is get yourself a little field monitor so you can really make sure that you're getting focus. You get that monitor, you get your hand under there to, to manage the focus. And really what this did is show me how much I really enjoy using a manual lens. You, have, you know exactly where the focal point starts and where it ends. It doesn't move around like the focus by wire systems. And it's just, it's a real joy. And the, the second thing that I really like is the clickless apertures. So you can make these small adjustments out in the field and, and nobody is the wiser. So it's just a really fun lens to use and I would recommend for 50 bucks it's probably a good tool for anyone's backpack. Anyways if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you have any experience with this Helios lens throw it down in the comments and until next time I'll see you later bye.
I'd like to tell you about it. That was terrible. This is, uh, this is, this lens is $50. <laughs> Fuck, this sucks so bad. <laughs>